all of, I've got everything we need. One goes in there. We go one and two. And then we go one and two. And we've crafted ourselves a musket. Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Echo. Welcome back to episode 18 of the Survival Craft 2 series. Now I'm here at the main menu, and that is because after reading your comments in the last video, so many of you have been asking me to use a texture pack. Now I'm not going to be using a texture pack today, but I'm hoping to in the next episode. I feel like it's a different challenge, it's a different change. So if I go to play, if I go to this world, and we go into uh, options, at the top, we have Block Texture Survival Craft. So I downloaded, let's have a quick look. I downloaded this one, which is Alter. I downloaded the Minecraft one, which I'm going to show you in just a second. I downloaded the Photorealism, which I'm not a fan of. And we also have the Neo Texture as well. So if we start off with, let's start off with the Neo Texture, okay? Basically, I want you guys to decide on what texture pack you want me to use. All I'm going to do is show you a brief look around and then all you got to do is leave a comment down below. So this one kind of felt a lot more medieval. Now I, I already feel that Survival Craft is a very medieval styled game, uh, but I like this one because my house looks good. I based all of the texture packs off my house. I just thought it looked really cool. It's a little bit brighter. I know it's raining, so it doesn't really, you don't really get to see the sky, so I apologize with that. Um, but what I'll do is I'll quickly go outside, I'll show you, oh yeah, by the way, I'll show you, these are the chests. They've got a skull and crossbones on them, and this is the furnace itself. Now the blocks have changed, um, I gotta be really careful though on what texture I use, because I'm still not fully used to the, the texture designs of Survival Craft 2 itself. But if we head over towards my farm, uh, I'll show you guys some of the crops, so of course we have here... They are used for making tops, I can't remember what it's called. And these are my pumpkins. Now the good thing about my pumpkins is I placed down the saltpeter and all of them are 100% good. But I made a mistake and I will go over that in just a second. So this is the first one that I wanted to show you. I will show you the Minecraft one. I was actually really impressed and early su really surprised at how good the Minecraft texture was. I, I literally felt like I was playing Minecraft. So go to options, we'll go to this one. By the way, the Alter Texture, the Alter Default 2.1, is just Minecraft. So if we go to this one, we're going to apply changes, we're going to play. I was so surprised. Wait until you see this. Look, it's just Minecraft. It's so cool. It's like a, a different way of playing Minecraft. Now, of course, the basic textures have changed. For example, this being stone brick looks exactly like stone brick. This being wood just looks like planks. The chests... I was really cool. I was really impressed with the chest. And you've got dirt inside of there. What's that? That's rotten meat. This is cotton wads, which looks more like a snowball. Crossbow. Uh, is that clay? It looks exactly the same. So the clay's looking the same. Uh, oh, you can see the furnace as well. You can see them there. It's it's really cool. And uh, this is glowstone. Wasn't a big fan of this change because we know that that's technically like a, a light in a box. Um, and we've got some other changes inside of here as well. So, guys, let me know. Do you want me to use this one? Do you want to use the previous one? It's it's absolutely crazy. Like, it feels weird. It feels like an advanced version of Minecraft. And if I'm honest with you, it feels like a, a modded version of Minecraft. And the sky just looks absolutely amazing. So this was the Minecraft one. Can we can we get out of here? Oh yeah, by the way, guys, I'm having a little bit of an issue, right? With the, with the rice seeds, I really couldn't figure out what was a rice seed. Which is probably the main reason as to why I wasn't, like, planting down any rice seeds. But this texture... Really helps me out, tell me what's uh, rice seeds and what's not. And i got to stay away from the cold biome, because I've just got rid of a cold. I really don't want to deal with another one. So there's one more texture that I'm going to show you. Um, you guys can, su can suggest it in the comment section on what you want me to use. However, guys, if you know there's any other textures that you think I would like, and they're not in the content section, please leave it down below. So the last one I'm going to share with you is going to be photorealism. I mean, I just didn't like it. It, to me, the textures just didn't seem really good. That's just my opinion. So I'm going to leave it down to you in the comment section on what you want me to use. So this is it. Like, I, I just don't like the wood design. Everything seems too much of the same. Nothing seems different. Like, this is the stone, of course. And, of course, this is the, the wood. I like the wood floor. Feels like old, crookedy style floor. I like that. Your head is getting cold. Dry your clothes. Oh, okay. We'll do that in a second. Uh, and that's like the stone. It's kind of like cracked. I just did not like this. So again, it's up to you guys in the comment section. 
let's switch back one last time and then let's go over what we're going to be focusing on in today's video. So in today's video, guys, I want to make a musket. Yes, I want to make a musket. Um, a lot of you are actually commenting saying, hey, you should make like gunpowder. I really don't want to make gunpowder today because I really don't know what gunpowder is used for. I just, I don't have any idea what gunpowder is used for. We're back to normal. Let's just quickly make ourselves some sticks. I'm just going to sleep as well. My guy keeps getting, oops, that's not the right way to do it. My guy keeps getting ill and it's absolutely driving me crazy. He just keeps getting sick. I don't know what I've done wrong. I don't know if I did anything wrong, but he just keeps getting sick all the time. All right, let's plant this down over here. Let's get ourselves some of this. This should dry my clothes and then we can, then we can sleep. So I'm just going to do this all the way. Let's sleep. Let's skip night time. All right, I'm only feeling a little bit chilly. That's fine. However, something really cool has been happening recently around my house. And that cool thing is animals are starting to spawn again. Now, what I mean by that is like in this terrain earlier on, I seen boars. I seen, I think it was like a moose. I think it's a moose or a deer or whatever it is. They're, they're starting to spawn again. I, I don't know why. Because going back to, I don't know, like the beginning, we killed all the animals and nothing ever came back. Now, it looks like I'm lying to you because I can't... There they are! As you guys can see, he's right there. I'm gonna get him. We need the food. Get him. Okay. Um, yeah, so they started to spawn again around here. You better not take... Seriously, you better not take my food. Guarantee you they're gonna be interested when this guy drops some food. You better back away, wolf. You better back away. Um, so I'm, I'm really impressed with that. Because last time I kind of like killed all the animals. I really don't want to just kill all the animals. I kind of want them to regenerate again. There's bears. We've killed. Like they're common. We always see bears all the time. It's things like what I'm talking about. Boars and like the, the panthers and the jaguars or whatever they are. We've seen so many of them. And I kind of want to bring you guys another water episode. I want to. There's one. Look. It's a deer. And yes, I'm killing it because pure and simply for the food itself. Because now we're going to have different food sources. So it should drop a little bit of XP and some meat. There we go. I'm also going to grab this as well. Yeah, I want to try and get an orca. Like when I say get an orca, I want to try and meet an orca because I've not done that yet. Uh, food. All right, they're going to be... You've eaten this too often. Need something else, you get sick. Okay. i got to be really careful. Some of this is like already terrible food. Oh well. But yeah, animals spawning. Kind of a good thing. It's starting to rain again. All it's done recently is rain. All right, well, let's focus on what I wanted to do. So... I want to start off by saying I apologize with what all you guys were saying in the comment section. Apparently, you all got really triggered because basically what I did is I placed down too much saltpeter. Apparently, if you tap it on one block, it spreads quite far. And I made the mistake of tapping it really fast. You better back away from my chest, big buddy, because I need to get inside of here. Because I need the hoe. Because we have rice seeds. I've been collecting a couple of rice seeds, uh, but I'm going to need the saltpeter. I, this is a bad thing because I used quite a lot of the saltpeter last time, didn't I? How much have we got left? This is going to be a good test. I've got 15 left. We're in a little bit of a predicament here. Let's put that in there and let's put that in there. Okay, well... Oh, that's going to be annoying. I can't do them. I can't do them both because one of them is like ready to spoil. All right then, all my food is looking good. I have seven cooked meat, which is actually the first time in a long time since I've had that. I've got a couple of these which are about to spoil, but I mainly want to get my wild rye seeds planted down. Also, I need to collect the, the saltpeter. Where is it? It's in here, right? I gotta be really careful on how much I use. Oh, I wasted so much. I knew I did something wrong with it. And is that an animal inside of my... Seriously? Oh, I left the gate open. That's my fault. That's definitely my fault. Get out of here. That was my fault. And also, there's another... That is a moose. I'm pretty convinced that's a moose. Whatever he drops on, I'm, I'm going to pick it up anyway. We're level 8. I kind of I kind of want to get to, like, level 10 if we can. And you know what? While I'm here, I'm going to throw... Wait, he wants the meat, doesn't he? Oh, he sure does. He's not giving up until he gets it. Now he's running away. <laughs> okay, let's get these planted down. Also, I need to break my these again. Now, another question I have, guys, is how long does the saltpeter stay there for? Like, if I've done it once, do I not have to place it down ever again? Is it stay there forever? It's kind of a question I have for you all. So, I'm gonna have to place down a couple of these. I did place down a couple already down here, but I think if I place down one here, it spreads out quite a lot. So, you can see that it's quite active. I don't know why I wasted so much of that stuff. I'm such a fool. 
I'm such a fool, and last one can go here. Which leaves me with a couple, actually. Yeah, we've still got a couple of them. Okay, so let's get these down. The reason why, guys, is I want to have some, um... I want to focus on bread as well. I need to... I need to start getting myself some bread. It's just something... It's just something a lot of you guys have been saying, is make sure you have different alternative food sources. Like, for example, I've got pumpkins, which is good. But, like, it's... It's... I don't know. I keep getting... Where it says, oh, you're, you're gonna die, basically. I don't trust this guy, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let him eat this. Yep, he's going straight for it. He can enjoy that. And I see another moose, and he's actually eating it as well. It's kind of like a little bit of a distraction. Okay, so I should probably take these. I'm gonna test this. I'm gonna take some of these, and then I'm gonna replant them and see if it does work. I can't believe I wasted so many of these, and I know so many of you guys got really annoyed with me, and I'm sorry. Okay, I'm still learning. I'm more than likely just going to turn all of these back into pumpkins. Um, and yes, we will make a musket today. That's the main thing I wanted to focus on. But you've got to keep your upkeep on your crops. Because otherwise your crops will want to spoil. You know what? I can use these ones and switch these out. This could be a tactical plan here. Let's do it. Okay. I don't want to do too many. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? I'm wasting my things. What did I do there? I'm wasting my crops. What an idiot. That's fine. One, two, three. I'm pretty sure we have some inside of here anyway. Do I have any pumpkin seeds inside of there? Do I? I have no pumpkin seeds. I got rye seeds though. Hey, I'm going to get these planted down. I may as well keep these. I'm going to stand. It's really easy to stand on the crops on here. I don't mean to, but I just do. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, we've only got a couple that we're missing. Right. Let's break these ones. I also need to break all of this as well because, guys, I'm needing... Uh, we're running out of co cotton, cotton wads, really fast. Because I'm, I'm constantly having to make things. Uh, we can do one, two, three, four, five. I think that's enough. That gives me 15. I'm going to turn one of the pumpkins into pumpkin soup. And I can see... See, not all of this has been done. You can see here, not all of this has like, got the white stuff on it. You can see that does, but that one doesn't. Okay, anyway, let's break the rest of this, guys. Gather my resources, see what we've got, and then focus on making a weapon. So this is the first time I can actually say my farm is looking pretty good. I've got 17 canvas, so when it comes to making specific things, we should be good. Uh, the reason why I've not put the salt pizza on here, guys, is like I said, this grows really fast and you end up with a lot of cotton wads anyway, so I feel like it's pointless. Plus, I'll be wasting materials. I really wish there was one more thing that we could... Uh, like plant down now another question I have for you is survival craft 2 still being updated today Are they still adding new things because I've not really seen anything about updates and stuff is he classing it as a complete game Is he gonna be introducing survival craft 3? I guess I guess that you guys who play a lot might be able to tell me this But I'm gonna keep this on me and gonna put this inside of my inside chest um, Probably should get rid of this though. I don't need to be carrying this I can go inside of there so again the main focus today because this is about to break, is I want to focus on the musket, which I believe fires musket balls or whatever they're called. I don't know what they're called, guys. I'm sorry if I'm wrong. I'm going to put one up here, then there, so we have some soup. We've got plenty of food. Things are looking good. How much canvases have I got left, by the way? Uh, none, so that's actually perfect. I've got a lot of iron, like a lot of iron. I don't know where I put, where have I put all my iron? That's a good question. Is it in here? There it is. I've got a lot of iron, and I need, apparently for this, I'm gonna double check the recipe here, but for this, we need iron blocks. We have iron blocks, and we have a lot of them. So if we go to, uh, we need to go to tools, right? It's in here. Tools, scroll all the way down, all the way down to here. So the recipe for this is one iron bar, which we've got blocks, and we need wood. And we've got all them resources, so this shouldn't take long. So let's create ourselves some blocks, which I believe is just nine of these. Very similar to how Minecraft is, so we need two of these. That's perfect. Didn't didn't hardly have any issues there. We need one more of these. In fact, we'll do this one. We'll do one inside of there. That's gonna annoy me. That can stay there. There we go. Two of them. So I've got I've got all of, I've got everything we need. One goes in there. We go one and two, and then we go one and two, and we've crafted ourselves a musket. Now I also believe if we do this, how do we make the iron rods? Is it is that how you do it? However, we make the iron rods. I believe we need the iron rods in order to do this because I'm, I'm not entirely sure how we fire this. Do we need gunpowder for this? Because when I was reading the recipedia, if we go over to this and we go to this, a musket can be used to fire musket balls or bookshocks. You can fire single bookshock balls 
but the shot is very inaccurate and lacks power. Okay, so we can fire balls on musket. Okay, so we need to figure out what it fires. So we can fire book shots or musket balls. So let's just quickly read that one more time. Um, nope, description. Okay, so if it's a book shot, it's inaccurate. Okay, so we need musket balls. I think. But we're gonna see this anyway. I'm just this is more of a learning curve for me. Okay, so let's go to this. What's the, what's the recipe for this? So we need to make iron bars. I need to figure out how to make an iron bar again. Oh. I feel like a noob because I'm always having to check the recipedia. But a lot of them I'm quite new to. So if we go to, I think it's items. It'll be in here. So to make the iron rod, we need two. Ah, okay. So two of them in a furnace should make the iron rod. So we do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, uh, eleven, twelve. That should be okay. Food is good. That's now smelting. All right, we're going to take a quick nap because I don't want to deal with nighttime. And then we should be good to go. Feeling a bit chilly. That's not a problem. I'm gonna eat this as well. We've eaten well. A couple of them. Every time I eat them, it says I'm gonna be sick. I just can't fix that issue. Uh, the salt, we've only got 11 of them. I'm probably gonna, I feel like every 10 episodes, we definitely need to do like a mining adventure. And as soon as I sleep again, it's, it's raining. All right, well, let's see. Let's see how this works. So I believe these go inside of here, creating this. Okay, I don't wanna make too many of them. I think that's enough. Um, so does that go inside of there? How do we, how do we do this? Hold on. Load it. Load gunpowder. So I have to load gunpowder first before we can load that. So that's why you guys were telling me to make gunpowder. Ah. Oh. Okay, so I think... There's a lot of going back to the recipedia to learn this. Um, we gotta go to items. Let's have a quick look at this. So we need to make gunpowder, which is, there it is, okay. So I need sulfur, saltpeter, and coal. All right, all right. <laughs> it's all a learning curve, guys. I, I'm sorry if I frustrate some of you because I don't know what I'm doing, but it's, it's very, very new to me. So I need one of these. I've already got the coal and I need some sulfur. So I need to get rid of some more stuff. I need to make some room here. Um, I guess the iron can just go and sit there and so can the rods for now. So I need, I think it's one of these for now. Oh, I gotta test this. I gotta test this out. So I think it was this one, then this one, and then this one. Yes. Okay, so we gotta load the gun. We gotta load this now. Let's try it. We loaded it. And then we put that in there. Oh, loaded cotton wad as well. Damn, this is such a needy weapon. Do I have any cotton wads? I don't got any cotton wads. Are you kidding me? I don't got any cotton wads because I used them all. Do I, I, surely I've got one spare. It's got to be some in these chests. There we go. Whew. We're getting lucky here. All right, let's load it. So we've got to load the cotton wad. And now load a bullet. Ready to fire. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Hold on. Guys, I want to skip nighttime because I, I, sorry, I want to skip the rain. Because I don't want to get wet and all my clothes break and get cold and die. All right, we're going on the we're going on the hunt. This is going to be really interesting. Do I have enough gunpowder? I have enough gun. I have enough to to reload my weapon anyway. Ooh, <laughs> I don't know what I want to kill first. I know I'm really brutal in saying this, but I'm looking forward to doing this. I want to go and kill something that's going to be beneficial to me. I don't need any any fur right now, so that would be a complete waste. Uh, and also my crops, guys. My crops. They're looking fabulous. Yes, it's about time they looked fabulous. I can't wait to make so much bread as well. We'll come back in a little bit. You. That guy. But he's, it's the moose. There's gotta be something else nearby that I wanna kill. Oh, he's killing the fish. Did he, just, did he just generally kill that fish? Oh, he's killing the fishes. The piranhas are attacking him. That's actually really cool. All right, you, I'm sorry. How do we do this? Ready? Oh! Okay! I completely blew him away. I'm sorry, Mr. Moose. I know I'm completely wet, guys, but I, I gotta... That was absolutely insane. Wait, how many bullets do you get, though? It's kind of a question I've got. Do I have another bullet? No, I need to load it. Oh, so you literally get one bullet. This thing is crazy. This thing is crazy fun, actually. Um... So, for me to load this, I need to do gunpowder, cotton wad, and then ball. Oh, we're gonna go find something else. 
<laughs> this is much better than the the crossbow. I feel like I'm gonna switch though from the cro from the sorry from the normal bow to a crossbow because I kind of want to see the comparison. This is quite an expensive weapon to use, but it's gonna be so much fun. I don't want to go too far. I I literally just wanted to test this out a little bit. I don't think I want to waste my bullet on on something like that. Oh, by the way, guys, I've got my whistle on me, and I learned from you guys in the comment section. I got a tap in the air. So tapping in the air is meant to be the way that you you bring your horses back. Wait, wait. Oh, what is why they just randomly spawned it? Yo, we gotta try this. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm sorry, but I gotta try this. Yes. <laughs> I'm so mean. I'm going straight to hell for this episode. Uh, f honestly, I'm so cruel. I, I, I'm so, so mean. Do I got any more that I could do? I don't. I don't got... I've got gunpowder, but I don't got cotton wads. This is such a fun episode. All right, well, either way, I am going to kill these. Because I wouldn't mind having the, uh, the food. Oh, he's strong. Is he a bison? He was really, really strong. There's two more. They are so much fun to mess around with, though. I can't believe I waited this long to actually do that. I have so much food. Food for days. I have crops growing. I, I actually feel like at this point in Survival Craft, I, I know how the game plays now and how it works. And how to play the game. Yeah, you better back away, boy. There's a horse! There's a horse! Wait, horse! Is he coming over? Guys, this could be the, the perfect... This could be the perfect episode. No! He's coming over! Is it my horse? This might well be my horse. Hold on. Hold on, I gotta put this on. No. No, 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 not again, not again. Okay, he comes back. So they listen to the whistle. I love this. So I gotta tap this on him. No, don't. We could be friends. I promise. He doesn't like me. If he runs away, he's not the horse for me. Okay, hold on. Right. So I gotta... Yes! Yes, we did it! Turn, turn, we're gonna get cold, buddy. We need to go. We need to get out of here. We're going home. I'm taking him home. Hopefully I don't die by the time I get there. Left. Okay, we're going over the bridge. This has been such a fun episode. Such a fun experiment episode. Not in the water, my friend. It's really dark now. This is it? Go, 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 go. I've now got a horse friend. We used the musket. And you know what? I'm loving it. I'm absolutely loving today's episode. Probably one of the most fun episodes I've had in a long time. All right, let's go and put him in his home anyway. We got this guy. I also need to feed him as well. Don't forget, guys, I've got to feed him, like, grass and stuff. All right, slow, 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 slow. Oh, I'm sick. Okay, in. Dismount. Lock. Lock. Oh, I didn't mean to punch him. It's okay, he's in there forever now. We did it. I'm sick as well. Guys. <laughs> Hopefully you have enjoyed today's episode. It's been a pleasure. It's been awesome. Leave your opinions down below. And I have so much fun with this musket. I'll catch you next time. <laughs>